गुड मॉर्निंग गाइज टुडे वे गोइंग टू चिकेन सर्किट फॉर अ मोटर क्रॉस डे लेट्स गो ओके सो आफ्टर दिस आई बुक डन ओला एंड वी वेर ऑन अ वे द मिनट आई रीच द आई कुड हियर बाइक्स एंड द मिनट आई वेंट नियर द मेन गेट I could see the people doing stunts in the parking lot. Well, that was really very exciting. The first thing you see when you enter is stunts. What can be better than that? If you're wondering why I'm speaking to you like this, well, the truth is I forgot to vlog when I just saw these stunts and you know the bikers riding on the track. I was just so excited and went into my zone that I forgot vlogging. Then it was time to watch some bikes do some laps. First I was waiting near a tire and this was the first turn. After that I decided to change my location a little to watch those bends clearly. That was super close. then one after another they kept coming and everyone's knees were so close to the ground some of the shots were just so unique like two of them doing it together there were three also at a moment then it was time for some stunts again i decided to go and watch some stunts meanwhile they were doing some laps it was looking just so fun i was enjoying a lot Now it's time for some B-roll with music. Have fun. Guys, I'm not even joking. This is so fun and exciting. I've got tons of photos. Let's get home and we'll edit them together. All right? Let's go. All right, guys. So we're at home. I have my system right here and I have the photos right here. So there were total of 272 photos of today. I brought it down to around 10 photos to edit right now with you guys because obviously I cannot edit 272 photos with you. <laughs> You'll be tired of it. So let's get right into it. All right. So let's start with the first photo. Let's go easy. So what I like to do is basically first I select a preset as my base. That is the first thing I usually do. So I'm just going to go over different presets over here and select something I like. this looks kind of good so what we're going to do next is i'm going to play a little with the contrast to make sure it suits properly i personally feel that editing is all about just playing with different sliders and figuring out what's good for you that's basically what i do Okay so there's some cropping needs to be done and a few minor adjustments I'm just going to fast forward this so that you guys don't have to wait all right I'll see you guys in a minute Okay so I think this looks pretty good Let's do a quick reference view This is the before and this is the after I like this one Let's just go on to the next photo. All right. So this is the next photo. I should say guys, this was my first time on such an event and it was super fun. Just look at this here. There's hardly any gap. These guys are just professionals doing it. 
So for the next photo as well, we're gonna do the same thing basically. This looks pretty good, I think. Yep. Let's do a quick before and after check. This is the photo before and this is after. Alright, let's go to the next image. This should be interesting. So, I just took this image because I thought I could do something nice with it. But I did not think what I would do. So, I think the first step again is to decide the preset first the first thing we're gonna do is just adjust the exposure the contrast highlights and shadows again okay so we're basically done so this is the before and this is the after I have kept this part and this part darker intentionally because I want the focus to be on the bike especially the front part of it and I really think it looks good so let's just move on with the next one so this right here is something that is pretty sick I couldn't shoot this car but this was so 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 loud and so beautiful the car was a total beast you know this was just going all out so again the same thing select a preset all right so we're done with this image as well let's do a quick check this is the before and this is the after so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna keep skipping forward a little by little so that you guys don't have to wait much alright there's nothing much to explain in these coming photos just enjoy the photos that's it Okay, so while I was editing this image, I realized that it's not completely in focus and that is my fault. But I took several photos so I think I might be able to find another photo which is in focus. But I'm not gonna look for it right now because I can't look for it in 220 photos right now. It will be a waste of time for you guys as well. So let's just skip it for now. Let's just go to the next photo, which is this one right here. Okay, so the same process again. I'll see you guys. All right. We're back to the stunts part now. Okay, so if you guys are wondering why I'm adding so much vignetting in all these photos right here, it's because I'm just trying to make whatever I'm clicking look as the center of attraction. So by dimming all the edges, I'm making the bike and the person on the bike look as the center of attraction for example in this image. So this photo is also done a before and a after. We've got three more photos left. Let's just finish them. I mean, there are more than 200 photos still remaining, but these are some of the good ones and I'll keep editing the others as well. I'll share some of them for you guys to edit as well. Let's see.
All right. The same routine before and after check. Let's go. Boom. So I tried something different in this photo. So I'll show you. So this is the original image and this is that if you see closely, so I'll just show you. I made this part a little more brighter so it actually looks like a spot on the photo but it makes it look more in focus and more attractive I feel. Let me know what you guys think but I really think it looks good. See? Let's go. Alright so where are the last photo? Again the same procedure. Alright. So before, after as usual. Okay. So this is it guys. These were some of the edits. Let me know what you guys think. I'll be uploading them on my Instagram as well. So if you guys like it, please check it out and like it. And share it as much as you can. Well, as I said, there are more than 200 photos still remaining. I'll look after them. I'll see what all photos I can edit. I'll edit them. Maybe we can have a small editing competition for you guys. Let's see, alright? There's a lot of time. So this is it for today, I'll catch you next time.